after the perk extraction, it goes in a drying cycle, um, fluffing it up, probably putting air through it, uh, and the garments will not shrink on a perk uh, dry cleaning system. Uh, at that point, uh, they are relatively done when the machine or the computer goes off. Uh, then I have the, the uh, ability to, to take it out. And then I would take the garment out. This is sealed very strong because of perk being so highly flammable. Your dry cleaning machines, you have strict you certainly don't want to, I don't want to inhale all the perk that I use day in, day out. Uh, so uh, neither would anyone else. So these, clean, these machines are insulated and uh, uh, formed so that you don't lose any of the, uh, the scent and the materials in it. I would take the garment out. I could then immediately hang it up and immediately take it to the, the uh, uh, presses, hang it for pressing. Now on a perk, say there is a spot on, on a, uh, an article that has perk, we could re-dry clean it and re-spot it. However, I sometimes, I can take, if there is a spot and we think it can come out with steam, we will take this garment, hang it, and use a hand steamer, which I have here, to work on the spot. Again, you don't want to use soap or all sorts of things on it. Steam should take it out. I sometimes use my fingernail, but we should use that blunt object that I used for uh, spotting. It, it does not uh, change the surface of the fabric usually, and we don't want to do that. So the spot is out. I can then hang the, take this to the process for either pressing or however we're going to finish this, maybe by a, a steam pressing.